Hey, 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 let's get up into this, let's get up into this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm grinding, I'm grinding, I'm grinding for y'all. So hit the subscribe button uh, if you want to donate to the channel. I do have cash out. It will be in my description. The cash out will be in my description. Um, because I'm not monetized over here, so any will, any do, any, anything will do. All right. Thank you if you, if you feel it. Feeling uh, in a blessed mood, but anyway, for real, down on the real topic, let's get into choir, uh, not choir. Let's get up into um, the situation where they were showing their house, where Bay and Muck um, were showing their house. Okay, I just want to you know the details of their house and seeing what they got for the baby. But my thing is this: I said this on a previous vlog. Why would you go out and spend all this money? And all this stuff on the baby when the baby's not gonna be with y'all twenty four seven. They acting like the baby gonna be living with them. Um, it's nothing wrong with getting stuff for the baby for the baby has stuff over there, like diapers and stuff like that. But they also get little as well. So why won't you just wait till the baby come over there? Like what what cry do? Cry get go to the store, he'll stop by the store and get his son some diapers. You know, we seen him in vlogs, get him on his way home. When he picked the child up, for he have some for the week, for the days he there, you know, why waste money, you know, and try to showboat and try to act like you get you have it going on, and all this extra money to spend and stuff like that, um, just try to prove a point when the baby is not even coming over your house yet. Wait till the child be coming over there, and then ain't nothing wrong with get a little onesies and stuff like that, like night little stuff. But still, some of that stuff gonna get smaller. Baby grow fast, you know. Babies grow fast, so why waste your money trying to show and get all this stuff and everything like that? And don't want to give nothing, don't want to bring nothing over there to love, love by Erica house because y'all think y'all are doing something big. And um, you know, I don't understand it. Keeping the stuff all at y'all house, like the baby gonna be there twenty four seven. When the baby probably be there. Uh, a week or two, uh, uh, probably a couple of days when it do, when I do establish the DNA test, or maybe I got to go through the courts and stuff like that, and he do have to pay child support, but that still don't get him, because just because the person pay child support don't mean he have full range rights, you know, uh, people get that conscrewed, get that misconstrued, um, yeah, so, I don't understand why y'all showing it, but y'all did not show the kids room. You know, I don't. You know, you don't have to show the kids room. It's their privacy. They probably didn't want their room showing or whatever. But you, you know, show showing all the stuff that y'all got for this house and stuff like that, and buying for the baby. And it's kind of like understand you're trying to support your man, babe. We understand that you're trying to support your man, but it's not your child, okay? Don't get too infatuated. With someone else's child, you supposed to love the child. Yes, you with him. You supposed to love and treat the child like it's your own. But still, in the back of your head, remember, this is not your, it's not your child. It's not your, it's not your. You not your be, the the be all of responsibility for Mux uh, and Erica, baby. That's their responsibility. You to be all responsibility for the two kids you get. Yes, it's your right to help you all together. You, you supposed to help. You supposed to. Uh, love the kids. You're supposed to help you help with the care of the kids when they in y'all care. But you get to the point where you acting like when you go shopping, you acting like it's your child, babe. It's not your child, okay? Uh, that's another thing I noticed. Like when you going to get the stuff, when you tell me this would be good, this would be good. We don't hear the mug singing crap, but uh huh, yeah, that look nice. Yeah, oh yeah, that look nice. Oh. He ain't really saying crap, girl. You the one doing all the talking. Okay, come on now. You he's not. He need to be running his mouth, not you running your mouth. You know what I'm saying? Um. Yeah, they were just really kind of weird to me. You know, he doing all you doing all the talking. He just up there agreeing with everything, everything you saying. Don't know nothing about no baby car seats. Don't know about nothing. So they let me know that he didn't help out and get the stuff when his kid, the mother did everything. The other kids, mothers did everything. I don't know if he got a son or not. I think it's his first son. But it's just really crazy to me that you sitting know, there acting like it's your child. Yes, because y'all in a relationship together. But relationship, you know, but that, you know, when you have a child, it's forever. When you're in a relationship, when you're married with somebody, it's supposed to, the marriage supposed to last, you know, for a long time and hopefully forever, but it's not guaranteed. And it could be temporary. So don't get all wrapped up 
and acting like you, um, stepmother or guy even marry his old girlfriend of the year when this is not your old child. Don't get super consumed with this. Don't get all infatuated with this and buying all this stuff and, um, to try to prove that you care, try to prove that you're um, in, it to, in it for the long haul. It really don't make no sense to me. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about her. Um, the home, they're showing their home and everything like that. The house is nice, you know what I'm saying? It's nothing, hey, kudos, the house is nice. Um, but yeah, let me know how y'all feel about it. See y'all in the next one. Um, let me know how y'all feel about them you know, buying a baby all these car seats. And stuff like that. Ain't nothing wrong with having a car seat. That's good. That's a good investment because it goes all the way up. Even it reverts to get, you know, to when it gets bigger. That's a good investment. But some other stuff, y'all could have waited on until y'all see what's gonna really, what's gonna transpire. Ain't no. I'm not saying that y'all not that y'all not gonna have the baby for the weekend. Y'all ain't gonna have the baby spend the night. But I'm saying y'all be wasting money until y'all know what the hell is really gonna happen and what's really gonna be. You know what's really gonna happen. I don't know. Nobody really know if he has seen the baby besides the time that Erica mentioned. I don't know. But um, yeah, let me know how y'all feel. Um, see y'all in the next one. Bye.